Hey everyone, thank you for joining me again. I'm just gonna give it a little bit of time, see if some people hop on here. So how's everyone's evening going so far? Hopefully good. Mine's good too. My week was long, glad it's Friday. <laughs> Hopefully you guys are glad it's Friday too. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> All right, a couple people are on. We'll just give it a little bit more. And then we'll get this show on the road. And I'll show you what I got in my box. I'm super excited. Hey, Christy. All righty. All right. Well, I'm going to get started. So thank you guys again for tuning in. It means a lot. So I got my shipment of wine today. Yay! It was delivered to my job. I had it delivered there because you have to have someone 21 or older to sign for your shipment. And I know there's always someone there and I knew that I would be there. Hey, Ashley. I know that I would be there at the office that day, so I made sure my wine went to the office, okay? Um, so every time I get my box of wine, it's like Christmas every month. It's like super exciting because you never know what you're going to get in the box. So um, this is the box that it came in, okay? And in your box, depending on what uh, package you went with you're either gonna have two bottles or four bottles okay I go with the four bottles and I do a mix so I get two whites hey Gina I get two whites and two reds all right and in the box I already took a peek because I wanted to see what I was getting <laughs> so in the box you'll get a little bit of a you'll get a flyer and then you also will get uh, wine tasting notes on each of the wines okay and this month I got a white which is a, this is a Chardonnay okay and then I also got a Merlot uh, last month I think I got a Malbec and a Chardonnay too and but they were from different vineyards so and then I got a, a Merlot and a, another Chardonnay but it's different than it was last week or last month actually so um, let's see what these wine tasting notes say about this Merlot. So this Merlot comes from, from uh, Woodenville, Washington. Okay, and the uh, Merlot is an elegant, elegantly balanced with aromas of cherries, bramble berries, and plums. So that sounds actually really good. <laughs> with some undertones of uh, subtle oak. This is good with... Uh, pot roast, game hen, stews, and smoked cheese. So on these wine tasting notes, it's going to also tell you um, what uh, foods to pair it with. So that's really helpful because, you know, we usually never know what to pair our wines, what foods to eat with it. So it always is really helpful. Hey, Sheila. Thanks for tuning in, you guys. Autumn. Um, so now I have a sh the Chardonnay, which is also from Woodenville, Washington, and this one is crafted in fresh, uh, with fresh, softly styled bright apples and sweet citrus fruit characters, and uh, subtle spice and oaks. So it says that it's a very clean, refreshing, uh, fruity wine. Hopefully not too fruity, but. Um, it sounds yummy and uh, it is good with vegetarian pastas white fish chicken dishes and also seafood such as shrimp or scallops so I definitely will be making something this weekend or this week to go with these wines for sure and um, while I'm on here too I just wanted to remind you guys a little bit about the wine tasting club um, if you join, you get your shipments to you monthly. Like I said, you get two or four bottles. If you get the four bottles, you're going to get two of the 
two of each wine, okay? So like I got two of my whites and then two of these reds. The whole reason we do that is because we want to, um, we want you to share this experience with other people. We want you to get in, get wine, and get social. That's the whole purpose of the Wine Tasting Club, okay? So one bottle for you, one bottle for you to share, or you can keep it for yourself if that's what you really want to do. It's all up to you because it is your wine, all right? Um, another thing I've done, I do the mixture, reason being is because I am a red wine drinker and I normally would not drink whites and mainly a lot of the reason was because I couldn't find one that I liked, okay? And with this, and I was afraid that if I got one that I didn't like, you know, obviously now it goes to waste and I can't bring it back to the store, they're not going to take it. But with this wine tasting club, if you don't like something, you just call them up, you let them know, and they will send you a new bottle, no questions asked, of a different wine. Or if something happens to the wine in delivery, you call them up and they'll send you another bottle, okay? You can't do that at your local liquor store. You can't go in there and say, hey, I know I opened this and drank some, but it's gross and I don't like it. Can I get another one? They're gonna be like, no, that's not gonna happen but we'll do that for you. So that's another thing where 100% customer satisfaction guarantee, which is amazing, okay? So I wanted to get on here and I wanted to share what I got, super excited. I'm gonna be cracking open probably the Merlot tonight. That's what I'm gonna have, I think. So I will make sure I keep you guys posted and updated on how each of the wines taste so you know and um, does anybody have any questions yes best customer service Sheila for sure do you have to pay shipping for or return the wine that you don't like um, if you if there is a wine that you don't like yes you do as if I'm pretty positive you do have to pay for the shipping but they they cover all state taxes and everything so you only have to pay for the shipping okay Yes, best customer service for sure. They take care of you. They want everyone to be happy. Any questions for me while I'm on here? Be happy to answer. No? All right. Well, you guys have a great rest of your evening. Okay? Enjoy your weekend. And remember to tune in for my Wine Talk Wednesdays at 9 o'clock. All right? And, oh yes, and Sheila did say you don't have to ship back the wine also. So if you did get like a four pack and say you didn't like this Merlot, you can go ahead and keep the other bottle that you didn't open and do whatever you want with that and they'll still send you two new ones, okay? So it does, it's really, you know, great because then you, if you don't like that wine, then you can share it with somebody else and maybe somebody else will like it too, you know, just because everyone's palate's different, you know. But, um, oh, and uh, Christy said if it is damaged during, ship, during the shipping process and you need to call, you don't have to pay for shipping. So thank you, Christy. That was good info to know. So only if it's that you didn't like it, you just have to pay for shipping. But otherwise, if a bottle came damaged in your box, you wouldn't have to pay for the shipping to get new bottles, okay? All right, you guys. Well, you have an amazing evening and I will talk to you guys next week. I'll, like I said, I'll keep you posted on how these wines taste. I can't wait to try them, all right? Bye, you guys.